My person is Booker T. Washington. He never knew his dad as a child and as a slave. He was a Browse boy and he's known for finding Tuskegee University and he was known for the first black person to find the university. Uh, um, I did Franklin Douglas and he was he was born in slavery. He he was the fourth of ten people in his family and he he taught other slaves to read and then for his achievements he um, was a civil rights um, writer and he was He was, he was one of the um, people in the in America, and I forget the name. But he was um, one of the people to be a, um, one of the best civil rights writers. Lefty Lloyds was born in Great Barrington, Massachusetts. He was born on February 23, 1868. He died on August 27, 1963. He became a professor who studied and wrote about black life in the United States. His goal was to win equal rights for African Americans. Mary was born on July 10, 1875. Mary was the only child in her family to go to school. Mary was the 15th child out of 17. She was recognized because she founded the, the National Council of Negro, Negro Women in 1935. I did Harriet Tubman, and the first question was, why is Harriet Tubman famous? Harriet Tubman was famous because she sit, saved slaves in the underground railroad that is a town of freedom in the world. When Harriet Tubman was born, she was born in 1840. She died in March 10, 1913. Interesting facts about Harriet Tubman. She was born a slave. People called her Moses. As a child, they called her Minty. She was a very religious girl. I did Sojourner Truth. Sojourner Truth was born in 1797 in Hurley, New York. Her name at birth was Isabella Baumfrey, and she was famous for her speech, Ain't I a Woman? She met Abraham Lincoln.